we're going to be talking about understanding dynamic range and headroom. Let's talk about headroom. What is headroom? Headroom is any signal that exceeds a nominal signal. So basically, if we have a 0 dB as clipping, and our signal has an RMS or average value of around negative 10 dB, we know that we have about 10 dB of headroom between negative 10 and 0. Therefore, let's say it's a lead vocal. The singer is singing at an RMS volume of negative 10 dB, but decides to say something louder that hits negative 5 dB, we're not clipping yet because we've kept enough headroom for ourselves. But the reason we want some headroom, and we don't want to reduce it too much, is that there's something called the noise floor. The noise floor is basically any unwanted sound that comes from plugging in a microphone and running it through a preamp. And if we have our signal too low in our gain staging, then basically at any other point in the signal flow, we'll be amplifying the noise floor with our signal. So we want to make sure that we give enough gain to our signal, we don't want too much headroom, but we also want to leave a good amount of headroom for our signal to have a natural dynamic range. Hi, you've been talking with me, John, an instructor here at the SAE Institute, and we've been talking about understanding dynamic range and headroom. For more tutorials like this one, please visit usa.sae.edu.